Oh, that's just so cute. Look at the kid looking out the, over the window. I'm going to the ice cream festival. What's up, peeps? Thanks for joining me. My name's Damon Warren, and this is Day One Adventures. Today's adventure, we are in Wilmington, Delaware, at Rockford Park for the Old Fashioned Ice Cream Festival. This thing's a lot of fun. It's not just about the ice cream. They got all kinds of things here. They even got bumper cars. Look at this, they got some bumper cars this year. I didn't even know that was a thing. So they got bumper cars with like literal bumpers around here. And then they have all kinds of vendors here, local artisans and everything. I'm not sure how many years this has been going on. I'm gonna check on that. But this is a, a great day. They're out here all day. There's even fireworks at night. This is like family fun for everybody. And this is definitely one of the family activities down here in Wilmington. There's plenty of food, ice cream, events. There's even a, a petting uh, area for the animals and everything. So we got some raw honey, local honey. Interesting thing about honey. I was having a problem with my allergies and my doctor suggested to me to actually have um, raw honey and local raw honey because it has from the local flora and fauna. So that's always good and healthy. And we got, give me some sugar right there. And we got, yeah. So some of the local artisans here. And there's a little bit of something for everybody. You never know what kind of stuff you'll find here as you walk around the classic food. Look at this, we got 3D, 3D printers over here. They got all kinds of stuff and colorful. They even do some tattoos. All right. Long range marshmallow shooters. Long range. <laughs> that was definitely long range. <laughs> that was a long range marshmallow shooter. <laughs> and then you can put a little stuff in your hair and everything. You got some t-shirts. Oh, look at these things. Nice and shiny. Then you got some community groups. And did I mention they got good food here? I'm gonna walk down the other end. We might be using some of this for big. Try to get this in before the band really kicks in. They have a number of uh, bands, some local and not some, some not so local. They come out to this. You got the sustainability. That is evil. That's what she told me. Originally, that's what it says on the paper. You got some nice jewelry here. Look at the jewelry. Signage. Got plants. I can't tell if they're plants or sweets. We got a little bit of everything. Okay. Uh, jewels. I think it's more like Lindella or something. Got some plushies. Oh, look at the turtle. Look at this. Shout out the turtle here. Turtle, turtle, turtle. Hey, turtle. Hey, turtles. There's a crab. Owl. Uh, I was going to say, where are the frogs at? There you go. There's some frogs. <laughs> we got like sea inspired jewelry here. Almost looks like the stuff that glows in the dark. I know, some of it looks like it does, doesn't it? Yeah. Only one way to find out wait until the fireworks. Hello. 
Oh, uh, look, we got uh, we got some bottles. Look at it, customizable bottles and stuff. I like the sippy bottles. I don't know what it is, but I like them. We got some artwork here. Very nice artwork. It looks like ceramic. Very cool. Very cool. Oh, wow. Look at that one. Yeah. So I will say, all right, here's going to be my catchphrase. The ice cream festival. It's got a taste for everyone. Nah. Something for everyone to taste at the ice cream festival. Oh, that sounds pretty good. We could go with that one. Thank you. Mm. Are the shirts in case you guys get lost? Huh? Are the shirts in case you get lost? <laughs> They'll easily find us. <laughs> There you go. I always want to mess with the jerky people. I'm like, yeah, I ain't vegetarian jerky. I wish. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> so they have a lot of volunteers that are at this. First state urgent vet. There we go. There's a place you hope you don't have to go to, but if you need to. They're available. That's it. There we go. Let's get back over that side here. And we got some dog treats. Junior's favorite dog treats. Oh, these are like uh, fine arts right here. Are these tissue boxes? They look like tissue boxes. All right. Like I said, there's a little something for everybody here. Cats and dogs. <laughs> oh, we got the candles. Are these candles? Oh, they're thermoses and, co and cozies. Okay. Yeah, that's kind of cool. And they want to look like just cheap stickers. Ooh, nice. Holly's tie dyes the designs. Okay, who's Holly? <laughs> oh, those are bookmarks. Oh, so you're starting out. There. Oh, look at it. Here, we'll give you a little bookmarks. Monsters are two, stripes are two, plain is one dollar. Look at those bookmarks right there. Those are nice. Very cool. Oh, they got googly eyes. Oh, those are the monster ones, I guess. Oh, see? Okay. That's right. All right, good luck with your sale today. And then we got some, got two artists here. Oh, we got some planners. Very colorful. Okay. I'm doing very well. And how about yourself? That's right. Well, it's not tomorrow. Well, hey. well tomorrow's supposed to be a different day. Yeah, we'll today. I'm going to stay in today because I like where I'm at right now. These pots are very nice. Are they all hand drawn? They're all hand painted. Okay. And treated for indoor outdoor usage. And I've staged some of the things that you can use them for other things too. Hi, my name is Tracy. Um, this is, I'm Tap Product. Uh, I'm a teacher and I used to paint as a way to relax on Saturdays to the point that they start taking over the house. So then I decided to 
try to find some vending opportunities to sell them. But everything is hand painted, treated for indoor outdoor usage, and you can use them for plants or other things. I am. Do you do classes on teach? On I painting? don't. I teach math. You teach yeah. math. <laughs> that makes perfect sense. You got to keep your brain balanced. There you so go. I like that. I there like that. Go. And they're very. I love the color choices. Thank you. My mother went to Africa. Went to Africa many years ago, and I still remember all her stories about it. So that is my love is to do some representations of Africa and. So I delved out to other areas, too. And she was a science teacher, so you'll see a lot of science stuff up here, too. Oh, okay. In so her honor. It looks like it runs in the family, it definitely. Yeah. Well, thank you so much. Thank you. I appreciate it. And have a great day. We will. Thank you. And thank this you. is my niece and my sister. Hey, oh, so this is a family We're affair. Family. This is a family yeah. affair going over here. Oh, so we got a niece and a sister? Yes. Okay. Oh, no. Yeah, okay. So, all right, all right. Okay, so how y'all doing? I'm a... I'm, since she sent me over here, <laughs> who would like to talk about they, what they got? My name is Kara Hinson, and uh, I'm an artist, a painter, and illustrator. And these are all my prints and original paintings. Uh, I have watercolor and digital illustration, note cards, large size prints, small size prints. Um, as you can see, I do a lot of portraits and um, figure illustrations. Um, so this is all of my work. How long have you been doing it? Oh, maybe about like 10 years now. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, it's been a while now. Is this your first time at the uh, ice cream um, festival? No, I've done the ice cream festival a few years. This is, I think, our fourth year doing this one. Okay. I think so, yeah. All right. Which one, which one of your relatives dragged you into this? I probably dragged them into it, to be honest. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, see, I had a feeling something was going on here. I was like, wait a minute. Yeah, okay. But, yes. Oh, you got time. Oh, all right. So you wanted to join in on the fun. Okay. Exactly. But yes, they're they're both artists as well. Okay. I'm Stephanie Henson. I'm Kara's mom and Tracy's sister. And I am an upcycler. So I find junk, different places, Goodwill, yard sales, okay. you name it. And then I try to turn it into something else. So you see I have old plates that I turn into cupcake stands and old teacups into candles and a lot of uh, sun catchers and wind chimes out of anything that I can find. So this is all from repurposed things? That you For the most part, yes. Most of, most of it is, uh, is upcycled. Okay. Mm -hmm. yeah, thank, you. thank you. And here we got some leather. I tell you, there's nothing, you can't beat the smell of like leather. This is, oh man, just reminds me of my uncle's shop. He had a shop where he worked on leather. And, oh man, his bags and everything. Oh my goodness. And we got Bear and Bird Company. Hey, look at this, see, look. Oh, thank you. It's, um, there, this is just like a, um, you, it's made out of food, but. Uh-huh. Oh. It, it doesn't taste good. It doesn't taste good. But it, it, smells, it smells amazing. It's meant to play with, right? Mm -hmm. But this is just a sit set um, open. Uh-huh. And this is some stuff over here. So folks can come and check out our sets. It's all sensory play. Oh, sensory. Yep. Oh, nice. It's amazing. Home -made, home -made sensory. All homemade. <laughs> Very safe. Oh. oh. Kids love it. Actually, adults love it. So we are the Bear and Bird Company. Okay. And uh, it's named after my kids' two nicknames, the Bear and the Bird. Uh, it's homemade Play-Doh sensory kits. Okay. Um, and it is basically open-ended, accessible play. We were looking for kits and opportunities for our kids to play with sensory stuff, but we didn't want to pay the money, the 60 bucks that we saw online, for them to maybe not even play with it. So we started to make our own we realized how essential it was, and we started making them for friends and as gifts, and then, you know, working with therapists, and we just want to make it accessible and affordable to people. So if you want a kit made of all blue stuff, we'll do that. Wow. You know, we do, we do what we can. For so. adults and kids. For adults and kids, we've had people send them to their kids in college during finals, and the whole floor plays with it. So, oh, yeah. yeah, it's, um, I could definitely see that. That is awesome. Yeah. How long have you been doing this? We've been doing this since November of 2021. Okay. So, relatively, 
relatively new, um, but very, very fun. And getting to see kids play with it here with the demo table and, and see them interested is my favorite part. So is this your first time at the ice cream festival? It is my first time at the ice okay. cream festival. Okay. Oh, yes. right. I'm thrilled. So you're so. in for a treat. In, pun intended, I am in for a treat. <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> Absolutely. I can't help myself sometimes. You have to do it. Yeah. It's... Why would you want to? <laughs> Spoken like a true younger brother. Oh my goodness. So this is definitely a family family operation. Yes. So it's it's woman owned. I'm going to tout that. Okay. Um, but it is a, a labor of love for my whole family. We have my cousin, niece here. Okay. We have my uncle, and then okay. we have my younger brother. So we have our advanced team, our employee of the month, and our um, adult support supervision over here. She did a great job. She hooked She's... me right in. Oh, yeah. No, I was you... like, no, I don't want to play. And it was like, okay, yeah, I'll stay for a second. You're like, so... maybe I'll just squish a little bit. Uh, but you have to. It's, yeah. it's soft. It's great. Yes, it it's is. made with love. Like, literally, this is the community angle right here. So you have all your community tents that are right here. Because one of the things is, I would almost say that Delaware really, Wilmington really is involved with with these different events is community. So you'll have your vendors, a lot of the local vendors. You know, you'll, you'll see stuff here that you won't see anywhere. You know, you're not going to find a lot of this in the mall or in a, on Amazon thing or whatever. And, oh, and it smells so good over here too. Oh my Most goodness. Soy wax candles, handcrafted into drinks and desserts. Oh. We have shot tumblers, Bluetooth speaker tumblers, wow. wax melts. And look at and look at the flavors. Oh yeah, we have um, all your bakery items, the banana pudding, strawberry cheesecake, oh. peach cobbler. See what they're doing at the ice cream festival? See, handcrafted items. This is like the best diet right here. You can just <laughs> smell as much as you want and not gain a Oh my goodness, this is. They need to bring back smell of vision. <laughs> Look at this. Pabones, prints, and scents. Haha. <laughs> very nice, very nice. Have a great day. Got some very nice. Uh, My favorite uh, water ice places is Dino's. One of my favorites. I got a couple favorites, but they're definitely one of them. And there you got one of the biggest uh, bag tossing uh, cup games I've ever seen. That danger area over there, that is for the um, fireworks tonight. Oh, we got a live one. Come on, there you go, make some look. <laughs> so you got a couple of different, you got you dairy over there. U Dairy is from the University of Delaware. The thing that makes U Dairy extra special is that they, um, their art, horticultural school, and they have their own cows. So they have their own milk, cows, and they make their own ingredients. And they come up with these really crazy flavors. So I would say U Dairy is known for their flavors of ice cream. They are like legendary. So let's take a look over here. See what special flavors we got. And I'll give you a little pan of their sign.
So that's you, Derry, right there. Farm at University of Delaware College of Agricultural Natural Resources. All right. What's up, my man? Hey, hey. Hey, am I going on YouTube? Uh, I guess. <laughs> what flavors we got today here? Let's oh, see. We got the best of the best. We, we got the best. What are you into? Oh, I'm not doing anything today. No. Not yet, at least. All right. Yeah, look at that. But see, they got all the crazy flavors, the good stuff. Fresh milk, fresh cream made right here. Pineapple and apricot sorbet. Oh, yeah. Nom, 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 nom. Blue vanilla, see? So they got all the good flavors. All right, thanks a lot. Take care, man. You can get yourself some deep fried Oreos. Plenty of barbecue. Well, here's a place over here I haven't seen. Now here's a place I don't think I've tried. This place is called they Cup and Cone. <laughs> We got some flavors here. I'm not getting in line, I just wanted to get a shot of that. Cannoli crunch? Zombie? Fusco's. And the best hot chocolate on the planet. Let me go to Woodside. And here you also have Woodside. Woodside has good ice cream. Let's see what kind of ice cream we got today. The award-winning Woodside. Got some vanilla, some chocolate, chocolate chip, cookie dough, peppermint chocolate, peach, motor oil, motor oil, okay. There you go. And if you've ever get a chance, Ever get a chance, they got a really cool place where you can get the ice cream fresh there with the seats outside and everything. Really good stuff. Cook 
because you got your funnel cakes, your fried Oreos, your french fries, and your corn dogs and apple fritters. I wonder what everybody's in line for. Is it the funnel cake or the apple fritters? I would probably go for the apple fritters myself. But. Today's flavors Fresh shrink pineapple Oh they got horchata Nice Oh, it's like this place they show you to making the donuts. That's right. Those are for my New Jersey people out there. I know we're in Wilmington right now. All right, beautiful. Ice cream, rock and roll. Yeah. Hayden Chance, ladies and gentlemen. How's everybody doing out there? I'm gonna play an original tune for you. This one's called Sassy. Yeah. 
You think I work for the radio station? Now, ladies and gentlemen, here we are on WSTW 93.7 in the morning. It's All day. Afternoon. Okay. All day. You're fired. All right. This is the afternoon. Anybody want to come and finish the, or play this game? Just get a partner, stand beside them, and we will go. Adults can do this too. We're going to be doing lots of shows, lots of games between the shows. That's right. No, we thank got you. 2 o'clock. We got the drama kids coming, so don't forget that. Anybody else? Anybody else want to play? Last call. Hurry on over if you want to play. It's grab the color bean bag. So, all right, here we go. Head, shoulders, knees, feet, shoulders, stomach. Pink. Oh, he's quick. Oh. He's quick. Oh, you got red. He no, got that's pink. red. That's pink. That's red. See pink. pink. Put it back in. Pink. Pink. Yeah. Pink. Yeah. Put the pink back in. Put it back Put in the hole. Pink back in. There you okay. go. Okay. Keep keep score, guys. Keep score. Okay. Head. Shoulders. Knees. Orange. <laughs> got orange. Orange. You're glad he didn't call pink. <laughs> Three to four. Okay. Orange. All right. Here we go. Head. Shoulders. Knees, feet, gray. Oh, gray. She got one. She's yeah. fast. She's getting the hang of it now. <laughs> Head, shoulders, feet, blue. Yo! Is that tied up with you guys now? It is it's tied, tied up, up here. It's tied up, okay. Don't forget, we are Superstar DJ. We can do all kinds of games at your birthday parties or weddings or anything you want. So take a card. All right, here we go. Head, shoulders, knees, feet, stomach, Greg. Ooh, he's one ahead she now. She took everything but Greg. <laughs> she takes <laughs> orange. She said her, her philosophy is grab them all. Yes. Orange and white, does that make Greg? <laughs> all right, here we go. Keep the score. Head. Shoulders. Red. Oh, he got it. You guys are tied up. Yeah, I think. Uh, by the way, everybody's tied. Okay. Here we go. Head. Shoulders. Knees. Shoulders. Brown. Woo!